Hello Aquarius, how are you guys doing? Welcome to my channel. This is C'est La Vie. I'm going to do a reading for you guys for the month of May. Let's see what's going on with your space, your energy, your everything. Um, sit back, grab a glass of wine. Peaceful vibes here, guys. This is a relaxation um, environment. <laughs> All right, so let's see what's going on. Like, share, and subscribe me. Um, yeah, so let's see what spirit guides have to say for you guys. I hope everybody's doing very, very well. Um, everybody's safe, comfortable. Okay, spirit, what is the message for the sign of Aquarius? Okay, that was quick. <laughs> Bodies of water spend times, spend time near water, such as a lake, river or ocean to recharge your batteries. I feel like you guys are just moving into a place of fluidity. Like you guys are no longer trying to force anything. You guys are no longer trying to um, force something that someone else is not working on. You're at this point where you're just trying to literally get back all of this energy that you guys possibly, you know, exerted onto the situation. Whatever the situation is, work, family, whatever it is, I feel like you guys were drained and you guys are coming into a place where you guys are finding more balance, moving towards a more balanced place knowing what you want okay yeah knowing what you want for sure the next one that came out is divine passion be honest with yourself what is your heart's true desire <laughs> what is your heart's true desire aquarius and then we have be strong you are stronger than you think you are and your strength assures a happy outcome all right, so let's see where this is going. I'm liking the vibe already. I'm liking the vibe. I'm already getting some, you know, this, yes, this can be love, but also this could be, you know, some of you guys trying to make a decision on a career path here, um, trying to find balance, trying to just let go and let God, you know, um, during this time. And just finding a lot of confidence within yourself, okay? Just, you know, whether it's applying to something or starting a new business venture, you're just like, I'm going to find my passion, do what I need to do, and let it be, all right? You guys are finding strength at this time where you guys possibly were playing, you know, in your head a lot about this situation, but let's see what's going on. Bottom of the deck, though, we have peace. There is no need to worry as everything is working out beautifully. Let's see what is going on with you guys. So I'm going to pull out three cards just to get a vibe here. Oh, the birds. Let's see what's going on. Spirit, what is the message for the sign of Aquarius? Sun, moon, Venus signs. What's going on with them? Give me a clear message to direct them. Clearly for the highest good spirit. Okay, I'll drop that. There's a lot, but I won't take place. All right, so first card that caught my attention was the Four of Cups. Hmm, Four of Cups. Bottom of the deck, we have the Six of Swords. I feel like some of you guys are just at a point where you're just rejecting any type of offer that you're not feeling is in alignment with yourself. Um, you're walking away from any sort of offers um, that you do not feel like serves you. Like, yeah, no, that's that's not what I'm looking for. You guys are in a place of more stability and knowing what you want, knowing what you deserve and willing to turn your back at any time. OK, and yeah, no longer just settling. Not that you were settling before, but now you're just like. This is what I deserve. This is what I want. And that's all. Someone may be coming back to you and you are not accepting their, um, 
how can I say this nicely? You're not accepting their um, somewhat half offer. Like you don't want that. You want the real deal. Okay. You want things to be out on the table clear. This is what you're passionate about. Let's be honest. Let's be honest here. You know, you know that offer is is not what you would offer somebody you love or somebody that you're you're you know wanting to move forward with. So take that back. All right, spirit. Some more messages for the sign of Aquarius. Okay, there we go. We have the magician. You guys are manifesting, manifesting, sitting in a place of yeah balance. Manifesting what your heart truly wants. No longer forcing anything. Anything. Nothing at all, baby. Spirit, give me one more message, please. One more, Spirit. Okay, thank you. We have the hangman. Yep, you guys. Hangman, eight of swords. Hmm. Somebody's not moving. Somebody's not doing anything. Somebody's not communicating. Somebody's not contacting. And I feel like at this time, you're being so strong. You're not moving either. Um, somebody's stuck. Somebody's stuck in a situation that is coming to an end. If your person is in a another situation or in a, in a certain state of mind, something is coming to an end. Okay? That energy of being stuck. The energy of... Um, being stagnant, feeling like they don't deserve love, feeling like, you know, they have to constantly uh, fulfill the energy of the past, okay? But here with the hangman, I feel like if this is you, Aquarius, I feel like this is you putting yourself in a place of, um, I'm going to look at this differently now, okay? I'm going to allow the divine to take over, um, I'm no longer going to, you know, try to keep on putting effort. The effort that I've applied is enough. I've tried, I've tried, and now it's up to the divine. I know I said that already. <laughs> but yes, but I feel like you guys are just getting stronger, okay? And if this is your person not communicating, not moving, not doing anything, you're fine with that as well. You're fine with that because you know at the end of the day, there's always going to be a happy ending, right? Right? can't run away from love okay so again i also feel like you know either you or your person somebody is really not communicating with the king of cups here this person may be like you know they have like this single vibe this single aura like yeah i want to be single they're all about their money you know they're attractive and they're just like yeah like i like you you know what i mean not really expressing their true desires and i feel like someone's in their head a lot about the situation nine of swords here somebody's in their head okay not not able to speak their truth not able to speak their truth at this time not able to speak up let's see what's going on spirit what is going on at this present time what's going on at this present time spirit it's gonna fire spirit what's going on at this present time what's going on spirit Oh, there we go. Oh, this person's dealing with a past person. Hey, yo. All right. Okay. Ah, oh, you guys may be thinking about a past person, right? Yeah. I feel like somebody's wanting to come in to communicate. We got the star card here. Okay, somebody wants to be transparent. Somebody wants to be transparent. They want to be clear. They are coming in, baby. This person's coming in. They want to communicate. They want to talk. They want to talk. And Spirit is saying, Aquarius, you guys are stronger than you think you are. When this conversation takes place, oh, it's going to be a whole different vibe. You are going to express to this person how you feel. How you feel how you felt, how you want to be treated, how you don't want to be treated, what you're, you know, what you're looking for, not putting any pressure on this person, just letting them know what you are looking for, because you're no longer wanting to force anything. If they want to not align, then, you know, it's out of your hands. But I get that this person is just 
wanting to be transparent they do they see a happy they see a happy dynamic with you we have the sun card you could be dealing with a leo okay this person wants a family with you guys that you guys may have children with this person or haven't heard from this person in a while i feel like they're going to come in but they're coming in so like in a very subtle way though they're coming in in a very subtle way all right what are we what is to be expected, Spirit? What is to be expected for my Aquarius? Be strong, guys. Be strong. Be strong. The Knight of Swords. This person may be very... Um, you'll see them as they're talking. They'll take their time. They're very. They're going to be very precise with their words. They're going to be very precise with their words. And if it's a text message, it's going to be like, like, where's this text going? Like, what are you trying to say here? Yes, I'm fine. I'm fine. Yeah, I'm okay. I'm alive. Yeah, I'm in quarantine. What's up? All right, there we go. Oh, this person's leaving a third party situation. This person's leaving. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Hmm. Got the Knight of Swords again. Three of Cups and the Four of Cups, guys. Hold on, let me clarify. I have to clarify. I have to clarify. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Let's see what that was. The Judgment. Okay, the Judgment. Be dealing with a Libra. Mm. You know, I feel like your person's wanting to come in, but going to bring a lot of happiness i feel like your person's wanting to come in but i feel like the obstacle is still holding on to the past someone here is still holding on to some past events that took place that may have hurt them or someone is still looking back at yeah but you were dealing with shaniqua or you were dealing with tommy or paul you're dealing with sarah Remember that? I feel like someone here is needing to let go of something that happened to them in the past. Maybe you or your person. I'm not too sure who this is, though. Someone's still holding on to that hurt in the past. Spirit, what's the overall energy for this reading? The overall energy here, Spirit. What's the overall energy? I hope everybody's doing very well. Let's see. I won't take that. Let's go. Let's get a flyer here. Spirit, what is the overall energy for this reading? What is the overall energy? Bear with me here. The justice. Definitely might be dealing with a Libra. Someone may have had a divorce or a separation. I feel like there was no balance in the past. And that's what this conversation is going to be about, guys. The imbalance in the past and the balance that's needed for the future here. That's what you guys are going to talk about. Okay, this person is going to possibly bring up something that took pa uh, place in their past. Okay, there's going to be some sort of conversation here where this person truly... Uh, you know, slightly opens up. It's going to take them some time. But you knowing this person, you're going to see where it's going. Yeah. But I feel like somebody is definitely looking in the past. And that's the problem here. But with this conversation, with this transparency that's going to take place here. Okay. I feel like. I feel like you guys are going to be straight forward again because I feel like a part of you is feeling like, are you going to ghost me again? Are you just going to walk out on our emotions here with the Queen of Swords? You guys are sitting here like, are you going to take this seriously? Because this is what I want. I want stability. I want balance. I want X, Y, and Z. So please, that's what I'm accepting. So if you don't have that for me... You know, but I feel like this person wants to give you that. I really do. Ten of Pentacles. Oh, my God. <laughs> Nine of Cups. Ten of Pentacles. This person wants to express to you how they feel. 
Aquarius. Who is this person? I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. This person, King of Cups in the past, this person was not expressive, but they want a family. They want a stable dynamic with you. They really do. Don't let them fool you. They do. They've been hurt in the past. They've been hurt from a, a, a connection, but they're coming out of it, guys. They're coming out of it and they want to talk. Okay, yes. The way they might come off, maybe like a little bit, you know, childish and mature, just because remember, you know, expressing themselves may be a bit difficult. So work with the conversation, okay? But I'm so happy for you guys, for, you know, for whoever this resonated for. Um, like, share, and subscribe. I will talk to you guys soon. Goodbye.